Hi folks, I've got a super nice box opening today. It's one of the precious pets. So I'll just have a quick look at the box first. So it says precious pets. They originally were called perfect pets. The lifelike breathing and then they've added huggable pet so i don't know if they made it sort of softer than it used to be the lovely packaging looks like a pet carrier well, toby's come to investigate so so it says now we're huggable adopt me lifelike animals that actually breathe i must say folks this is sort of the nicest packaging i've ever seen the top of this box opens up like um like a proper pet carrier just look at that folks how cute is that it's even got breathing holes that is so cute okay so without further ado let's let the pet out of the box So, little pets in a plastic bag. He's got a nice bed. And here we've got a certificate of adoption. So this is to certify that this precious pet's pet has been adopted by a loving and caring new owner. Ha <laughs> ha! Not cute. Hey, what do you think of this, Paul? It's signed by the executive breeder. <laughs> <laughs> We've also got here, um, caring for your perfect pets, animal. So it's important to remember it will need some time to adjust to its new surroundings. Training your pet. Perfect pets, animals need very little training in order to remain the perfect pet. That's good. To ensure your pet is ready for adoption, each one goes through obedience training in the home of perfect pets i love it very thoughtful i love it build a bond with love and affection make sure to pet your perfect pets animal at least once a day it loves the attention and it helps it dream about you oh. and finally grooming perfect pets animals clean and groom themselves but only in private <laughs> If you notice your pet missed a spot, gently wipe their fur with a damp cloth. Absolutely love that. That's yeah. fantastic. Okay, so let's get the little pet out. Feels quite heavy, so presumably he's already got his battery in. Takes a, a D battery. A D battery? Yeah. It's got a collar on as well. And this is a nice little bed. He's got, I think Toby might steal it. <laughs> and I bet you he does. It's got a uh, perfect pets motif on the back. Mm. That's nice. I like the corduroy. Mm, it's nice, isn't it? Mm. Okay, and now oh, very special perfect pets. He slept through all his journey. Mm -hmm. Oh, he is nice. Look Very at that. Cool. Don't you think that's super, super lovely? Mm, unusual. Mm, oh, that must be the breathing mechanism there. I wouldn't say he's huggable. He's quite hard, I think. So I don't know where the huggable comes from. He's got his little perfect pets tag. It says perfect pets. Do you want his name on your <laughs> Engraving on the other side. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Okay, so we've got a tag here. So there's no instructions of this. So presumably. You know, you just pull them out, don't you? Oh, look. Oh. Oh, it feels like it's nice and soft. Little tail. So is the breathing mechanism going all the oh, time? Oh, his tail's kind of like poseable. 
That's nice. <laughs> the rest of them sort of rigid. Mm. Just, uh, when you stroke the breathing mechanism over it, does it also feel like? You feel it going in and out? Oh wow, yeah, you can. <laughs> I'll let you uh, experience yeah. you feel the breathing. Yeah. This is super sweet, folks. I find it, I think that is quite therapeutic. Mm. I like the slightly fuzziness about it, the fur on his feet as well. Oh, doesn't it look contented? It does, it looks beautiful, yeah. Now, there's one thing about this puppy, folks, that is a big downer pulled the tag to start it there's no button no on off button all we've got here is um a screw for the battery compartment and i do believe i read something about this i believe you can only stop it by taking the battery out so we're just going to unscrew this and see if there is an on off switch inside but i have a feeling there won't be Paul's got the top off the battery box now and it is as I thought there is not an on off switch and funny enough Paul's seen a hole here as if he were going to put a switch in but they haven't. Maybe for cost reasons. Mm. Thing is though even if it did have a switch there you don't really want to take the cover off the battery box to, <laughs> to get access to a switch anyway do you? No. So, oh, that's interesting. The battery is uh, press, uh, branded up. The heart of perfect pets. Yeah, that is a big downer, isn't it? I suppose it's possible to put your own in if you've got that capability. Like somebody called Paul. <laughs> is this a possibility then, Paul? Oh, yeah. Oh, that would be fabulous. I think we wouldn't want the switch inside the battery box so it would well, you'd want it you'd want it just there wouldn't you yeah underneath the fur maybe yeah so folks project coming yeah, it's a cute looking puppy that it's meant to be a puppy isn't it yeah oh yeah definitely a puppy very realistic folks what sort of breed do you think it's supposed to be it's supposed to be a chocolate labrador, chocolate labrador. Yeah. so that's it folks very sweet Little sleeping pet. Yes, they're settling on the sofa then. Particularly like the corduroy bed, nice feature. Oh yes, yes, that was a great bonus.